Hey, what's up guys? It's Nelson here with Gadgetax, and today I'm going to show you how to use one hand to manage your applications and settings on your Nexus 6 device. So with larger phones, it's more difficult to do the things you want to do with one hand. So today I'm going to be showing you an application called Lazy Swipe, which you can use with one hand to access all of your favorite applications and settings. So the first time you download Lazy Swipe, you'll need to grant access for notifications and applications. You only need to do that process once, and it's very intuitive, so you don't have to worry about it at all. So once you're done with that, you can bring up the Lazy Swipe menu, which you can do by swiping up from either the left bottom corner or the bottom right corner. So all you have to do is swipe up. And here you can see the menu. There are three different categories. It's Toolbox, Favorites, and Recents. In Toolbox, you'll find all your favorite settings. Uh, here you can see Wi-Fi, Flashlight, Bluetooth, Brightness, Airplane Mode. If you want to add or get rid of some of the settings, all you have to do is hold down on one of the icons. And then to get rid of it, you press on the red X. Or to add one, you can press on the plus. And here you can go through uh, some of the settings. You can have up to nine at one time. If we go to favorites, here you'll find applications. Uh, same thing with the way you use toolbox. Just hold down on an icon to get rid of one and then press the plus sign to add. And here you can see all of your apps. And finally, you have recents. Here it'll show a mixture of both settings and applications. And here you'll have up to nine icons at a time as well. Uh, if you want to change some of the settings, we can go to the application itself. So find lazy swipe and here it is. Here you can enable or disable lazy swipe. You can also set a time when you can swipe up the menus. So you can either swipe it in your launcher, launcher and non full screen apps and launcher and all apps, which I have currently enabled. You can also change the area where you can trigger the menu. So I have bottom left and bottom right. You can also set middle left and middle right. And you can increase or decrease the trigger area position. Here at the bottom, you can see how large the area for the position is. And if you move this around, you can see it change. And finally, you can set app notifications. So you'll be able to see notifications for these certain applications uh, directly from the lazy swipe menu. All right, well, that's it. Thanks, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and check out the full tutorial over at Gadget Hacks. All right, thanks, guys.